Hey everyone, it's Jay again, and uh, I decided to make a Miskers video, and I haven't made a Miskers video in such a long time, so I decided to uh, make a Volcano Island video and talk about all this stuff that's been going on in my life recently. And uh, okay, well let me let me just say what's going on first of all, and I will make a proper update video soon. But basically, um, I don't have my PC at the moment; I, I just have my laptop um, for now. And it will be like that for about a month until um, around February 7th or 8th, uh, maybe even 9th. We'll see what happens. Um, so yeah, I don't have my I don't have my PC for a while. I just have my old laggy laptop here, which is why um, yeah, it looks like everything is glitching out. But uh, still, you know, I'm able to make videos and I'm having fun and. Uh, I eventually clicked that expansion thing. Um, oh yeah, so here I am leveling up Valentino and some other biscuits that I don't really know very well, and I'm messing with my settings. Anyway, so obviously it sounds like I've I've played this before, and I'm watching it, and that is exactly what's going on. Um, I decided to record everything live, and of course my laptop decided to not save a single piece of audio because it is just the best laptop in the world, and I'm actually going to stop this audio real quick to make sure it is actually recording. Okay, good news, it finally is actually recording my audio. That is great to hear. Um, I don't really know how to fix it. I remember I used to know back in the day, I thought I had to play music or something. Like, I, my laptop has a way to, to make it so where it saves the audio. But it's because it's just really weird. It, it doesn't like saving audio. Um, and you have to do something to make it save the audio. You have to like be playing music or something like that. I can't remember because it's been so long. Um, but I tried doing that. I tried playing music while I was saving the audio. And I guess it didn't work because I have no audio. And I tried recording a couple more times, seeing if I can get the audio to work. And the audio never worked. So, I hope I don't have to do voice narrations over every single one of my videos this month, but we'll see. Because I am still trying to stick to my New Year's resolution of making a video every single day. So, we'll see how that goes when uh, my laptop doesn't want to save audio. Eh, it's going to be rough. Uh, anyway, after a while here, I, I realize, you know... You guys probably don't want to just watch and you know I mean a video of me leveling up Valentino and four or well, three other random miscreants. So I eventually head back to town here. Let me uh, go ahead and just skip ahead to that part. Anyway, here we go. I run back to town and I was like, expansion. What is this? New zones. Miskirts Dawn of an Adventure, coming soon. We're celebrating the announcement of a brand new Miskirts expansion by offering special deals in the Miskirts shop. Check out a number of exclusives and great Miskirts at a 50% discount from normal pricing. Special deals. So I thought that was awesome. I went ahead and I was like, oh man, I gotta check out these deals. And this little crappy thing pops up. Which, um... I was going to edit out, but I was like, you know what, I'm just going to show it just to show you guys how crappy this laptop is being on me. And I get all kinds of like little pop-ups that happen. Uh, <clears throat> but hopefully, sorry, I'm adjusting myself. Hopefully, well, this bed is squeaky. Hopefully I won't have to deal with that for the rest of the month, but we'll see. Uh, I'm going to do my best to fix it and make sure that the videos are a little bit better quality than this one. <laughs> um, anyway, so then I'm like, you know what, let me go ahead and uh, show you guys, because I, I, I have Goldie now, and I couldn't remember where Goldie was, and I found that it's Beam. I don't know why his name is Beam, but I guess that's his little, his highest evolution name. Um, and I decide to... Uh, Show them off a bit. So at first here, I, I decided to go up to um, Arobia and level up 
Valentino a bit, but I only do like one fight and that's it. And then I decide to go to the Platinum Arena. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make this video a lot shorter than it actually was. Uh, and uh, just go ahead and, and skip to the Platinum Arena. So anyone who knows me and has been watching my videos for long enough, you guys probably know that um, I really do not enjoy PvP that much. I just don't have a lot of fun with it. Um, I don't know if it, if it's more team based and more strategy based. Um, I have fun with it, but I don't know. I don't. I don't really have a lot of fun with PvP, especially in in Miskrits or um, or Ninja Saga. So I don't usually like to do it, but. Um, I know the Platinum Arena is kind of worth it because you get Platinum. And that's actually the reason why I'm actually fighting right now is because I realize I'm like nine Platinum away from a Frozen Coin or a Molten Coin. So I'm like, uh, okay, well, let me go ahead and and uh, do this. Um, and thankfully, no one's on and I get the bot, uh, Wilford. And I know Wilford's a bot. So at first, I'm like... Okay, well, I can do anything pretty much. I'll just I'll just uh, use mudslider driller over and over and over again, and I I get pretty close to dying in the very first fight that I have. Um, and not not, not all maskers. I mean, just beam by himself. I mean, beam is pretty pretty ridiculous. He, yeah, it's one of the reasons why I kind of really wanted to get the Molten Coin for him is because he's already pretty ridiculous in defense already. So I really wanted to get that Molten Coin for him and make him, like, even just more ridiculous in defense. But uh, I ended up getting the Frozen Coin for him in instead, as you'll see at the, uh, the end of this. Now, one of the things that I brought up in the actual recording is that um, I do still really appreciate all my Miskris fans. Thank you guys so much for for loving the series. I mean, I really never thought it would get this popular. Ever. Really. I never thought this series would get popular, but I really have a lot of viewers that watch it, love it, and when I stopped playing it, I had a lot of people complain. They were like, hey, you know, bring this series back, and, and you know what? Now that I have my old laptop back, and now that I have, you know, can't really play a lot of games that, um, are very graphically inclined, I guess, um, that take a lot of uh, power to run and need a good graphics card to run. I can actually go back and play Miskrich, um some more. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna for the month. I'm gonna try and and, and make some more Miskrich videos, and hopefully again I can fix my audio. But anyway, one of the things I want to bring up was that uh, you guys kind of noticed that I'm not very good at this game. Yeah, I do have a lot of miscrits. Yeah, I have played a, for a while. Um, but, I mean, I never got really into this game. And that's actually one of the reasons why I think I was able to stop playing so easily. is because I really didn't find this game to be that fun, personally. But, you know, I want to play for you guys. And I want to get better at it for you guys. So, if you guys have any hints or tips for me, you know, and, and, and ways to help me get better... Uh, let me know, you know, I, I do read the comments, and um, a lot of things that people keep telling me to do, though, and, and the, one of the, the only other thing I really refuse to do is to spend money on this game. Um, I spent a lot of money on Ninja Saga, and I know that one of the reasons why I'm so good at the game is because I spent money on that game, but I'd like to become good at Miskrits without spending money, so I can show that you don't have to always spend money to be good at these games, you know? You, they, they don't have to be pay to win. They can be play to win. So, I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah, you, a lot of you guys are like, oh, just go go buy that one miscrit that costs like $17, and or, or go buy the miscrit that costs like $25, and, and he's amazing, and, and he's just like fantastic, and you'll just always one-hit people with him. And I'm like, that's not the point. You know, I'm not playing the game for that reason, but uh, the I I mean I, I can't lie and say that I've never spent money on this game, but I've only spent one dollar. I've only spent one dollar on this game because there was a deal a while back, and I even forgot that I did it because I really thought I had never spent money on this game. But there was a deal a while back 
where there was like a hundred token, uh, excuse me, a hundred platinum coins or uh, or two hundred platinum coins or something like that for one dollar, and I was like, okay, I gotta do this. I cannot, I cannot pass up on this deal. So. The only other thing that I might spend money on one day is uh, to go into a new area, but I don't know. If you guys ever, by the way, there is one way I can go through this rule here, is if you guys ever donate money to me specifically for that reason. If you ever guys are like, here, here's a Facebook credit card, Facebook credits, um, use this and buy this misgrid. Or, or go to this zone and catch this miscreant. I will do that. So that's a one way to get around my little rule. But anyway, so this is the last miscreant fight I do in the Platinum Arena. Again, fighting Wilford the Bot. Um... I really like this miscreant, uh, and I, I do, as you saw in the first fight, if you guys are actually paying attention to the fight, I just did Driller and Mudslide, Driller and Mudslide, and then this fight, or no, I think near the end of that fight, I was like, oh, I'll do Synergy, Thorns, 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 thorn, Synergy, and I'll just keep spamming that, um, because I wasn't reading what the attacks did, <laughs> so Synergy, what it does is it gives you a heal over time, which is awesome, you can just pop it once every four turns or whatever, so that it never goes away. Uh, Thorns puts a three turn damage over time on the enemy, but heals you once for 15 health. So what I was doing was I was, uh, doing synergy uh, and Thorns, maybe, maybe even spamming Thorns when I was low on health, but after a while I'd do synergy and Thorns once each, and then I would do, like, Driller twice, Thorns again, synergy. So I was going to make Synergy Thorns, Driller, Driller, Thorns, Synergy. So that I would always keep the dots going. The dots and hots, if you guys know MMO terminology. <laughs> I used to play a lot of WoW. I used to play a lot of World of Warcraft uh, back in the day. Um, a lot of my friends disagree with me when I say that statement. A lot of just friends disagree with me and say I didn't play a lot of WoW. And maybe I didn't play a lot according to them. <laughs> but, I mean, I had... I had two level 85s and, like, a lot of characters. I had, like, I had like 14 characters, like, most of them level 60 or higher. And, you know, I had, like, 100, I don't know, I feel like hundreds of hours in that game. And uh, I still had friends that didn't that always complained that I didn't play enough. Uh, maybe because I, I used to get on, like, an hour or two a day and only on rare days. So I would spend, like, eight hours a day. But anyway, here's where I go, and I finally buy um, the uh, Frozen Coin is what I end up choosing, and putting it on Goldie. And then I realize that I have, like, all these other relics, and I'm like, where did I get these? What am I going to do with them? I try selling them, and I find out that I can't. If, I can, if you can sell them, please tell me how, because I'd rather just sell them and get some money for them. Or I'd rather, I'd rather get platinum for them, but if, even if I get gold for them, I'll sell them for gold. Um, and I, I end up putting one on a random miscrit and realizing that you can replace them by destroying the old one, which made sense to me, so I figured that that's how it worked. Um, and that was how I ended the video, so anyway, I guess that's it. I shortened this video quite a bit, it was like 23 minutes long to begin with, but I, I cut out some of the boring stuff. But anyway, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. If you guys want to see more, and I promise uh, I will do my best to make sure the quality of the next one is, is better and that the audio is working correctly, so I don't have to voice over it like I did this one. Uh, if you guys liked it, please give me a like. I really appreciate it. Comment below if you guys have any tips, you know, or anything you guys think that I should know about the game. If you guys want me to try catching a specific mystery, let me know where it is and I'll go and catch it, you know? And that's about it. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Later.